oh, I was doing every, anything people told me that I need. Girl, you need a calendar. You need to be doing it. I was on there. So how soon did you get, with, who was managing you before? It wasn't. Nobody never managed me. I ain't never had no manager in my life. Amina, I met Amina like, I started all of this like January of 2005. I met Amina like halfway, like August, September. That's when I met Amina. So I've never had a manager. Like to up to now, I've never had a manager. I've had like assistants and people who helped me, but I've never had a manager in my life. I've been doing all this myself. Well, maybe we didn't know any better. We didn't know that we could go through and be successful without sleeping with, you know, the photographer, sleeping with the producer. You know what? When girls, um, when girls, when to me, when I feel like women sleep around with people to get to get further or something. I always feel like you don't think nothing of yourself. You don't think you could have did it without that. That's how I always thought to myself. I must, so I don't you think sleep enough. Sleep around because you, you just want to sleep around. I don't think I'm, um, I'm good enough. <laughs> so that's what I tell them. You, you, obviously you didn't think you was good enough to do it on your own. Yeah. That's what I tell them. And I also think like, well, but that, give me maybe, something to wipe my lips because this hair is sticking all over. Because I think that's what I'm trying to get at. How did you know to do the website so quickly and to do the calendar? Because somebody told me. Well, somebody who told was, you, so you just had good people around you. Or were these family members? Like, because my thought mm. process wouldn't have been, okay, let me immediately do a website. Let me immediately. Do I did a website like the first three, four months I was in the industry. And that's because people were telling me that I needed to do it. But just other girls? Like, uh uh, uh uh. Uh uh. Like photographers. So a lot of photographers. A photographer you. was telling me, well, you, you need to do yeah, a yeah, website. Yeah, so you are just good. That. And so I the jumped. photographers have been good to you in the industry. Mm -hmm. Hey, what's happening? This is Trey, the photographer from Detroit, Michigan. We up in here doing the Bucky the Body. What's the name of your book, Bucky? The Vixen Icon. The Vixen Icon. And we got the, uh, the hottest team on the planet assembled in one place to pull this project together for Buffy. Why? I don't know. But we're here and it's hot. Check it out. This is the last shot of the day. Thanks for all of y'all continued support. Um, the Vixen Icon will be in stores June 2009. So look for it. My first book. I'm the author all by myself. Nobody else. Um, thanks to all my fans for your continued support. I really appreciate it. Thanks for making Buffy the Body what I am today, which is BTB Enterprises. So continue to support me. Um, the book is basically about my life, me growing up, uh, my different phases of life, really, and up basically up until where I'm at now. So very, very interested. I tell it all, y'all, so you need to pick it up. I don't hold nothing back. Nothing at all. Love you. Bye bye. <laughs> oh, that ain't funny, y'all. Oh, this dick. That's what's funny. <laughs>